Wasting. Money. Money. What is this, one, two, or three? Two. <laughs> so you may get confused. It's my camera, but uh, Dennis uh, has, has already embarked on a journey for Star Trek Into Darkness, a special steel book, which we were told dwells in this Walmart. I heard that's real steel. I don't know what your journey has been so far. Has it been treacherous and horrible and long? Yes, it has been. Uh, apparently, this movie is out of print already. Well, not the movie, the uh, Steelbook version of it. It also comes with the, was that, an action figure? It's like a uh, mini model of... It said on the website it was 24-7. What? Gross oh, mattress. these just these, oh. these doors. <laughs> oh, my gosh. All right, hopefully these doors are open and we'll get inside. You found it. But it's 40. Yeah, we thought it was 30 before. It was, I was told 30. It was. it was 30 before? Yes. Can we price match with the past? I don't know. Hot I've Wheels. never even seen this movie. Is the Hot Wheels figure really worth it? So you say no? $30, yeah. I would have. You would have said yes to 30. But about 40? this, Dennis, Dennis. Let's say tonight, let's say it was $30. Mm -hmm. And we go out to Taco Bell, mm -hmm. and you spend $10 on Taco Bell. All right. Get that for $40, we won't go to Taco Bell tonight. You just save $10, there you go. Well, now I just want Taco Bell. Do you get three coupons if you were to bring this to Best Buy? For upgrade and save? Yeah, it's three movies. I don't know. Very philosophical question. <laughs> Wait, keep walking. <laughs> he was out of pants today, so he had to wear some really old, really tight pants. It's really tight, particularly in the crotch region. Like Spider-Man. You're Spider-Man today. Oh, All right, man. Ryan's got a skadoodle. It's about uh, midnight 30. It wasn't a failed mission <laughs> because we bonded. We bonded through this catastrophe. James bonded. All right, just so that we're not here for no reason, hold this. Yeah. Show that you're holding it. I'm we had it. we had the opportunity to buy it, but we're saying no. We're bigger than the Star Trek and in Darkness box set. We're bigger than it. Mm -hmm. No, stomp on it with your foot. We're pirates that we dig up the treasure, and then we say, yeah, you know what? We're too good for this treasure. And I like that movie. It was good. You like Taken Two? I liked it. What? I heard horrible, horrible things about Taken Two. I liked seen it. it. I have nothing horrible to say about. I think you interrupt, you interrupted my treasure analogy. What's up, uh, Wasted it's Money 2? What about you? We just got out of Walmart and, uh. What? Anderson's being strangled. Anderson, we need oh, help. We I was left. following Anderson's car to get here to Walmart because I have no idea where this is and I don't know how to get home. Oh, oh, he saw lightning, so he was wondering if our windows were closed. Oh. Wow. I guess he doesn't care. <laughs> Anderson cares. Okay. Thank you, sir. You know, I'm not going to ask for directions because I'm a guy. So if we get lost, right. you'll know. We will talk to you later. We don't need to ask for directions. We don't need a GPS. All, all we need is a compass. Do you have a compass? Uh, no. Not a literal compass, an inner compass. Can you look your a finger sense. and... Yes, I'm talking like that. Like we, I'll lick my finger, stick it out the window, and that's... Yes, we'll yeah. get home. Okay. We'll get home. North See you at home. that way. She's cheating. She, you told you said to get away. a compass. Cheater. I said lick your finger, stick it out the window. Which way's north? That way. That's cheating. That, that's how we're getting home. Hi, wasting money. Two. So we found our way. We used our inner compasses. We used our wet fingers to find our way home. So we're gonna show the Blu-rays we have gotten in the last few days. It's a new concept we're gonna try. We're gonna show you our Blu-rays that we bought. Brand new concept, let us know if you like it. I don't think this is gonna work. But it's different, no one else is doing it. You know, let's do something different. It's original. It's original, it's original. right. So, I started off with Best Buy a couple days ago, would you say? Me and John went to see The World's End, and we went to Best Buy, and they had a bunch of Blu-rays with coupons on it. So, oh man, what, what, what should we get? Coupons for The World's End. So I got Shaun of the Dead. Ooh. Is that better than The World's End and Hot Fuzz? <laughs> Really hard to pick which ones you like better because they're all really good. It's I, so funny. Shaun of the Dead, 91% on Rotten Tomatoes. 
Hot Fuzz, 91% on Rotten Tomatoes. The World's End, 90%. It'll get up there. You critic that li- that didn't like it, like it, just to make it all 91. Mm-hmm. Then the other movie I got, it's a blind buy. I'm going to give it a shot. And then the other one, at Walmart, just walking around. Man, uh, I feel like you've shown this before. No, all of Denzel's movies look the same to me. <laughs> all right. What did right. you get? So when we saw The World's End, I got this movie just simply because he got Shaun of the Dead. So I was like, I, I actually wanted that one. But since he got that, I got Hot Fuzz. Wait, I thought I waited for you to pick and I got the opposite of you. Well, I just picked this up to look at it, and then I decided I didn't want it, and then by that time you had picked up Sean, so I kept this. Oh. I had a job interview today, and it was really, really far away, so I did the trifecta, Target, blah, 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 and at Walmart they had a bunch of $5 Blu-rays! And so I finally got this. It was only a matter of time. Batman the Movie, the 1966 version, and then I can't believe I got this, but this is not a good movie. The League of Extraordinary Gentlemen. It makes it worse because it's it's Sean Connery's last movie. Look at that cover! It's, yeah. I love the cover, so I said to myself, hey, for Sean, for the cover, for the price, I'll get it. All right, so that's the Blu-ray update. I don't know if we'll keep doing this. <laughs> it's kind of silly. But uh, tonight we're going to have a movie night. Another new concept. One of the $5 Blu-rays at Best Buy is Dodgeball. I've only seen parts of this movie. It just looks like a stupid comedy. I'm in the mood for one tonight. You are too. Are you excited? I'm very excited. Are you excited? Ooh! How do you know? Dejba. Dejba. It's a recyclable case. I'm gonna kill everyone. <laughs> oh, they try to hide it. Run! Oh, he's running. So we're going to watch Dodgeball. Hope it's good. Ahoy there, wasting money too. We just finished dodgeball a rooney Oh, what do you think? I love the movie. You've seen it's, it before. Oh yeah, many times. You have not. I thought it was very funny. Yeah, I laughed a lot, lot. I was just expecting... What did I just say? I was just as- expecting a whole lot of, like, balls jokes. And there were, you know, a few here and there. How could they resist, but... It was the quirky characters that did it mm-hmm. for me, I think. And they knowed. They knowed. <laughs> <laughs> I did not drink. <laughs> Although I will admit, I was. I'm just getting over an anxiety attack. <sighs> I don't know, whenever I drink a Coke, it's the caffeine or something. <laughs> but I've had energy drinks. I don't know why. I don't know. I have a job interview tomorrow morning. Maybe I'm freaking out. I don't know. But I, I just. I'm getting over an anxiety attack. My last big anxiety attack, panic attack during a movie was uh, the new Evil Dead in the theater. Did I tell you that? No. I didn't tell you that? I was sitting right by you and you had a panic attack? What? Yeah. Yeah, I was I was against the wall, so like <laughs> I would have had to like scoot past everyone to get out, but so I didn't want to distur- disturb you guys. And I didn't want to miss anything. I paid for the movie. If you've seen the new Evil Dead, it's the worst movie to have a panic attack for. But anyway, this is this was a good movie to have a panic attack because it calmed me down and made me laugh. So thanks... Oh, hold on. This is your channel. Yeah. Well, you could still... Thanks for watching, yep. right? No, no, no. All right, well, you have been watching Wasting Money 2 with John kind of at the helm. You're doing it all wrong. What? <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. What? Continue. Uh, I'm so proud of you. You've grown up. You're your own host now. Try to. Just throw it up. I'm just kidding. What? Oh, show off your we... Star Trek Into Darkness gifts. Oh, that's right. Yeah. $40 is ridiculous. It is. Do you guys think it's worth 40 bucks? Dora the Explorer question. <laughs> Me too! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, see you till next time. You can't feel the side of your tongue? Stop <gasps> filming!